Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to record your computer screen on Windows in 2022. Okay, so many people ask me how I record my computer screen and how I create my tutorial video. And actually, I record my computer screen almost every day. So it is a daily work. I record the screen and edit my video and publish it to YouTube and uh, sometimes I also record the screen for my e-learning course also. So in this video, I'm going to show you a free software that you can use to record your computer screen, audio and webcam and your mouse cursor effect and so on. Okay, so let's go to my computer screen. All right, so now I'm inside my computer screen and actually the intro of this video is created by Active Presenter. That is a software that you want to download and install it on your computer. So if you want to use this software, go ahead to the link I put in the description or you can check this website. So go, go to their website, atomysystem.com. Uh, okay, so just go to this website and then just select the download button here and then select Active Presenter. And being mentioned that this software work on both Windows and Mac OS, so you have to select the right version for your operating system. If you are using Windows 11, Windows 10, 8.1, or 8 or 7, or 64 bit, you can click here to download the software. For Mac OS, you can click here on this area. Okay, so just click here and it will download a file to your computer. And then you just need to double click and install it with a few click. Okay. So once you install the software, you will have a button on, on your desktop. Okay, so this is a shortcut to, uh, to open Active Presenter. You can just double click to open it. Uh, by the way, I already opened it. So let's go back to the start page. Okay, so when you are here at the start page, and you, if you want to start a screen recording, you can click this video, record video. Okay, or you can click blank project to create a new project and then you want to start a screen recording. By the way, I'm going to select this button, record a video. Okay, so this is the recording toolbar. So let's hide the desktop first. This is the recording toolbar and it is very easy to navigate. The first area is the recording area. You select this one, it will record full screen, meaning that it will record your computer screen. And for this one, you can select a custom area on the screen. For example, you can select this custom custom button and then you want to click here to move the recording area. And you can also uh, click the mouse, click your left mouse cursor and then resize the recording area. It is very easy. By the way, normally I will select full screen recording. Okay, and on this side, you have a, your webcam option and your audio option. For the webcam, you can turn on and off your webcam with this button. And you can also click this drop down menu to select the webcam that you want to record. Okay. And for example, I can record my integrated webcam because normally it will take control of the, uh, my Canon 800D here. So this is my, uh, my webcam with my built in webcam on my laptop. So you can also change it to ES webcam utility. And I think I should press this button. Uh, to get the webcam Okay, so very nice now I get get my webcam with the EOS utility So this is a webcam option. Okay, and right here you have your audio option You can just adjust the volume of the audio by this button Okay, and you, if you want to select the the system cell or the microphone you can click this drop down menu so here I, I use this one. This is the USB microphone that I use for this video. And if you want to record the system sound, meaning the computer sound, you can select here. Uh, or you can uh, select do not record system audio to just record the, the voice from your microphone. Okay, and when you are ready, you can click this button to start your recording. By the way, if you want to deep dive into the recording setting, you can click this, uh, menu, uh, this button and then select recording setting. Here you have the audio and video and cursor and hotkey. Uh, you find the hotkey to start and stop your screen recording. And also the cursor effect, if you want to record your cursor effect or not and make it editable. Okay, so right here. But for me, I think it's okay. Just leave it by default. And let's click save. And now I'm going to click this button to start the recording, okay? Just start the recording and it will count down 3, 2, 
one and now everything on my computer screen is recorded okay with my webcam so my webcam may be right here at the right corner by the way you don't want to care about your webcam because with active presenter you can also edit your webcam and resize your webcam uh, easily okay so for example we can right click and refresh and we can open the web browser and for example showing you okay so this is a home page of Adobe system and you want to click the download button and, and go here and to download the software for example something like that and now if I want to stop the uh, recording I can find it at the notification tray on the right side just click here and then you can click this button to stop the recording okay just stop it and now it will be in the editor so this is the video editor of active presenter and here you have the uh, project file and then we can play the video the computer screen is recorded okay with my webcam so my webcam may be right here at the right corner by the way okay so for example this is my webcam so i can select it and then i can move it to anywhere on the screen for example i want to just uh, make it smaller like this and put it right here and this is my cursor effect uh, where i can adjust it on the right side at the property so when I select the video, video on the timeline, then I can adjust the cursor effect right here. Okay, for example, I don't want to have a yellow. I can change it to red uh, mouse cursor effect. And I can also increase the circle here. For example, like, let's say 20. For me, I think uh, 16 is okay, but let's increase it to 20. And also increase the opacity of the, of the cursor effect also. And you can even change it to different size, different type, like circle or square. Okay, so let's play it. The computer screen is recorded. Okay, with my webcam. So my webcam may be right here at the right corner. By the way, you don't want to... And being mentioned that with this video editor, you can also cut and trim your video easily. And you can also, for example, increase the volume. Uh, let's select the, the audio here and also select this volume slider and then I can boost the volume of my audio also okay so it is very easy let's listen to it yeah about your webcam because with active presenter you can also edit your very nice right and if you want to uh, split the video you can select this one for example select select here and then make uh, make use the handle here and then see uh, select this button delete strain to delete something here Okay, by the way, I'm going to delete this one. And if you want to uh, add text or add some special effect to the, to the video, it is also uh, possible. Just go to the insert tab and you have many options here to insert a text, insert a shape and many things like spotlight, effect equation, or icon and stuff like that. But for this tutorial, I just want to show you how to record your computer screen with audio and webcam. Okay, so if uh, you want to export it to mp4 for example to for uploading to YouTube then you can just go ahead to the export tab right here and then select video to export it and now you want to find the location to save your your video for example I can save it in this uh, active presenter folder in the video so I'm going to type a name here example okay and let's save it and now we can click OK to export the video. Okay. Two thousand years later. All right. So now you can view your screen recording. Just click yes to open the output file, and then uh, this is the video. Just double click to play it. And now everything on my computer screen is recorded. Okay, with my webcam. So my webcam may be right here at the right corner. By the way, you don't want to care about your webcam because with Active Presenter, you can also edit your webcam and resize your webcam uh, easily. Okay, so for example, we can right click and refresh and we can open the web browser and for example, showing you. Okay, so this is the home page of Adobe. Now, if I want to stop the uh, recording, I can find it at the notification tray on the right side. Just click here. All right, so that is how to record your computer screen on Windows PC in 2022. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comment section below. And don't forget to download the software at the link in the description. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you 
in my next video. Bye.